final bout, we're at the top of the bracket at 133 pounds. The number one seed, Dayton Fix from Oklahoma State University. He'll be facing Luke Fletcher from Ohio State. Shane, what can you tell us about these two wrestlers and their style? When it comes to Dayton Fix, it is all about pace and pressure. And you look at Luke Pletcher. Pletcher is tough to score on. He's got that low center of gravity. Hard to get underneath his quote-unquote pad level. Tough guy to finish on. Looking forward to this match. Of course, Pletcher has great hips for a 33-pounder for sure. Fix has the big quadriceps, though, the strong back. It's going to be a real battle here. Fletcher, an All-American last year. He was fourth in Cleveland, 133 pounds. Some would argue this is the toughest bracket this tournament has seen in its entire history. This bracket is loaded. You have Michich and Soriano on the mat next door. Great semifinal here with the Big 12 and the Big 10 colliding. Of course, Dayton Fix with a record of 33-1. and one. Strikes first. He's in on Fletcher's leg. Dayton Fix... Working to get that second leg, improving his position. Two points on the clock for Dayton Fix from Oklahoma State. Dayton Fix has a lot of offense. And now he'll go to work on top. He saw what Miller did from Virginia in our 125-pound final. And I expect Fix to show a commitment in this top position. Tight waist hook on the right side. Going to slide the boots in. Got right that great cowboy. line there. Yes, you betcha. He's riding them. Cowboy Nation should be on their feet at this one. Of course, Fletcher coming into the bout with a record of 26 and 5. Fix putting pressure on the back of Fletcher's head. Now he's got his forearm bearing down, driving Fletcher's face into the mat. Fix from Sand Springs, Oklahoma, Charles Page High School, where he won four state titles. Fletcher from Latrobe, PA, Greater Latrobe High School. I believe he was a four-time Pennsylvania state champ. Two four-time state champions battling head-to-head. -head. Ryan Hagen is our official. Look at the, the pressure from Fix. He's got that hammer lock on Fletcher. Fletcher in trouble on bottom. Flat on his belly. And you can see the facial expression from the Buckeye Pletcher. He is getting worked. The pressure on his left shoulder. That is a sunken half super tight. They'll call it potentially dangerous, and John Smith is hot. John Smith has taught that in the room. I've been in that wrestling room, Shane, and I've seen that being taught. It's a tough move, and you've got to execute it very, very carefully. I agree with John Smith. Pletcher right there had a choice to make. You bet. He could either give up, Lay down, or whine about it, you know, and he's a good athlete. I know safety is first, I just disagree with that call. It's the right. Division One semifinals, let these guys go. Dayton Fix, a junior world gold medalist, a two-time world bronze medalist. Wrestled, of course, the year at 133 for the Cowboys at Oklahoma State. He's putting the pressure on Pletcher. Pletcher's going for the sidelines, going for the out-of-bounds. Fix stays right with him, though. What are your thoughts when you see a defensive wrestler going off, 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 uh, off the bat like that? I mean, there's really nothing else he can do. There's no other place he can go. Fix had the pressure on. He couldn't turn to his left, couldn't turn to his right. Fix now pulling Pletcher back. Just really impressed. You look at a guy like Fix, just a complete... Wrestler, solid in all positions. Monster on top, not surprised here. I figured he'd show commitment in the top position. And look at Pletcher again, just unable to establish any kind of base. Fix is pulling back on that right arm. It's a, it's a legal move. He's also then putting his forehead on top of Pletcher's head, or his hand on Pletcher's forehead, pulling the head back. Punishing move. Over two minutes of riding time. Fix dancing around. The choice goes to Pletcher. He defers. And Fix elects bottom. We've got 2.04 in riding time. 2-0 in favor of Dayton Fix from Oklahoma State. Pletcher solid in top position. Very good mat return game. He'll need it here. Fix quad pods up. Claw ride from Pletcher, pinching that right side. He's got a thigh pride out of his feet. Looking for a return. 
And he does so, returning fix to the mat. They go out of bounds. Ryan Hagen on the whistle. He'll bring him back to the center of the mat. J.R. Johnson working the perimeter. Fix settling in in the bottom position. Fletcher covering. Quick, explosive standout and able to escape. Great work. Fix puts one point on the board, an additional point now with a 3 0 lead. I like his urgency. I mean, he scores that takedown a minute in, builds his riding time at two minutes. Quick escape. Riding time now down to 145, but still a quick escape for the Cowboy Fix. Fix going back to the center of the mat, backing up. Collar ties now by both wrestlers. Pletcher with a arm sweep, trying to maybe gather some garbage underneath there, that ankle if he could get it. Fifty-five seconds remaining, second period. Dayton Fix with a 3-0 lead. Clutcher beat the number four seed, Mickey Philippi of Pitts, 3-1 in the quarterfinal. Philippi handed Fix his only loss this season. And it's physical down here. It's tough. These are two laser-focused athletes. Talked about it earlier today. You can hear the physicality. You hear the bodies banging, the bones colliding, the hard hand fights, collar ties. Short time here, 10 seconds in the second period. Fix and Pletcher both with collar ties right here in front of the mat table. And after two periods of wrestling, Dayton Fix from Oklahoma State with a 3 0 lead, 145 in riding time on fixed side of the clock. We're going to start in the neutral position. Well, we have to. I mean, that's the choice Fletcher's got to make. Again, why is he going neutral? Because Fix is so tough on top, you're not going bottom. Yep. When you're tough yep. on top, it changes everything. Again, both wrestlers now forehead to forehead with collar ties, now backing away. And if you're Fix right here, you're looking to put a cherry on top. Don't shut down. Get another score, and if you're Pletcher, of course, got to find a way to get an angle on Fix, who maintains really good position. Just look at Fix. He stalks. Taking territory, moving forward. I'm in control of the bout. Back, coming back to the center of the mat. Ryan Hagen with the whistle, resuming action. 125 remaining third period. Nick Soriano leading Stevan Micic on mat two. Fix beat Soriano in the duel in Piscataway. Fix and Micic have not wrestled this season. As we approach one minute remaining in the third period, Fix in on the single leg, but we're out of bounds. Well, I like what Fix did there. He was able to circle in and then attack at the edge. Not necessarily an attack to score, but an attack to show the referee I'm staying active with my offense. And to let Letcher know he's there. Does it again? Yeah. He's savvy. Wise beyond his years. Very mature and cerebral for a redshirt freshman. He comes from a great wrestling family. And his uh, father and grandfather, I believe, wrestled at Oklahoma State. I remember his father bringing Dayton up to me and introducing him at... USA preseason nationals, I think he was in eighth grade. Yeah. Seems like yesterday, but he's tough. 30 seconds remaining, third period. Pletcher with the front headlock. Now trying to shut Fix. Fix doesn't have anything to do with it. Again, the Ryan Hagen says we're out of bounds. We're coming back to the center of the mat, neutral position. That quick start, most likely going to be the difference. That first period coming out, setting the tone. Fix really has dialed it back just a little bit right now. That cost him, though, two points. Pletcher getting two. Now Pletcher will give the escape. He'll try to give the escape and try to go for two on a takedown. Eight seconds remaining. But even that riding time is locked up. Right. Dayton Fix is going to wrestle for a national title tomorrow night. As a redshirt freshman from Oklahoma State. We 
Debbie Winner from Oklahoma State University. Final score 3 2. 4 2 with riding time. Dayton Fix with the win moving to the national championship tomorrow night right here in the arena. You're watching NCAA Wrestling Championships.